Hey everyone, welcome back. Guess where I am? I'm at Ocean Beach in San Francisco on this beautiful Saturday afternoon. I thought I'd come out here because they're having a sand castle competition. And there's all this uh, crowds here um, making sand castles right now. Elementary kids teamed up with um, architects and designers from what I understand. Uh, so uh, let's go check it out together and see what we can discover. All right. Okay, let's go take a look at the wild sand castles here. It's stretched, you know, three or four hundred yards across the beach. All right, here's one of the sites now. Site 11. What are they making? Oh, I see. It looks like a face. There's some pumpkins, maybe? I gotta go around to the front and take a look. Site 11. Looking good. I think it's a skeleton. Right? Skeleton head? <laughs> skeleton head? Looking good. Okay, we got a surfer guy out there. All right, let's go see some of this other competitors. There's a lion walking by. Rosa Parks. She's working hard. That's awesome. So what's the, um, is this a Egyptian theme or what is it? It's a sand castle. Sand, I know, just a castle? Yes. Okay. It's um, creation. It looks great. This one looks really good. This, one. this is the model, I imagine. <laughs> Turning that into that, they did a great job. I like the ghost on the end and the wood used, driftwood for the skeleton teeth. It's very nice. The detail's great. So this is site 12. The detail on the teeth and the headband. And this is a cat. Cat's cool. I really like the cat dragon, I guess. Site 12 did a good job. I'm gonna pan over. Imagine if we're going in order, this would be site 13. So again, these are um, elementary school kids with the help of some adults. Look at the pumpkins and the, the ghost. I like the, that's, that looks like um, one of the Pac-Man guys from the arcade game. Looks very good. And the pumpkin. Ghost School. Team Ghoul School. This got t-shirts made up too. Alright, what do we got next? You know, I'm I'm gonna go to the beginning and walk my way down because I'm not doing them in order. I just got sidetracked. So let's go take a look. We are looking at 10. I think we looked at 11. No, we looked at 11 and 12, not 10. So we got to go down to 10. Oh, 
These guys are making the sand just the right consistency. It's hard work. The weather is like perfect for this that kind of work right now. It's 62 degrees and sunny. It is perfect. Welcome to San Francisco, right? Okay, we got another one over here. I don't think we saw yet. This must be number 10. These guys are working hard. And what is this? It looks like a bug. We have a giant drone flying over us right now. Look at this. Drone, wave to the drone. Is this an ant? Some kind of bug. Pretty cool. Okay, it's Spinoza Halud. Uh, one of you, one I'm of you guys. Go the other side. There's the tools of the trade. Gotta have a good shovel for sandcastle build. Oh, that was the butt. That's pretty cool. I like that one. This is the Play Doh version. Play Doh and Real. Another great one. So, this is number nine. I like the cat, the toes. Oh, let's see, there's the model of it. That's a good one. Classic. Excuse me. That's what it's supposed to be. It's number nine. So, what do we got next? Number eight. Looks kind of crab. That's a crab. It's got to be a crab. <laughs> That's a good one. Looks like a crab. And it's got a bag of candy. Crab with loot. Cute little dog. Okay, this is Lucky Seven. Lucky Seven site. Skull and crossbones, couple heads. I think that's an elephant trunk over there. I'm not really sure. I don't see a little mock-up of it. So, still did a great job though. I like it. Site seven. It's like you see all these kind of tools when you see concrete guys working. The sand tools. This looks cool. Some kind of ghoul. We're in site four. Another really cool one. I like the skeleton. And the skeleton hands. They did a great job there. Cool. Yeah, the skeleton's great. And then this over here is number three. And these broken shells for the mouth and eyes. Very creative. 
And we got a little uh, mock up here. It's a spider of some kind. Let's go see the next one. I like it. Oh, they're getting eaten. Oh, no, she's getting dragged away by a spider. The spider's awesome. You're not scared, Lana? <laughs> Brave. I love the pumpkins, too. The faces of the pumpkins, the evil looking faces, are really great. And of course, the spider. This is who? These two in a row are, are really great. Okay, what do we got next? And this one I think is two or three. Two. It looks like a. It's uh, a bat. A bat. It's a bat. Thank you for explaining it. Yeah. <laughs> no, the ears, well, you, did you the participate ears are, in this? Yes. The ears did, like are too far back. The ears needed to be up, and they aren't. It looks a little walrusy. Well, when I walked up, my initial thought was Egypt. Yeah, because, because you saw the, the giant the, paws and the the hand. Yeah. And, uh, well, it's a skeleton hand grabbing at candy, and then this is a goizum moon because oh, it's a Chinese. Oh, I can see that now. Yeah, that's awesome. And then a bat, and then this is a coffin that says 2023. I think the the bat the issue is the wings, right? You can't make the wings. Yeah. They just and, fall over, right? Yeah. <laughs> and the ears. It's the, it's the ears. Oh. See the ears that are creepy. Are you guys, is everybody done working or are they continuing to work? No, we're done. We're done. So, so this, as you heard, is a bat. Oh, we got a little picture of it. Skeleton hands. Bat body wings. Candy tomb stones. Candy tomb stones. This one did a good job too. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh. Yeah. Uh, they said they over the four flockets, but then again, they had gone up. We're going to walk down the beach. You brought your cat? That's awesome. Hi. We went, we tried to go to the, um, Dolores Park cat thing. Do you know about that? We saw it on Facebook that people on Saturday, certain Saturdays are supposed to bring their cats to the park on leashes. Uh, we got that, but unfortunately the minor little one are able to fit on the smaller size we bought. So we got to wait for Not a little yet. while. That's cool. I have two cats. I've, I love cats. He's adorable. So it's pretty mellow, huh? Oh, yeah. He's super active in uh, love bonding, love company. But loves being in there? No. No. You can see it chew, trying to chew up the door. Trying to get out. Like, Is yeah. it a boy, girl? It's a boy. What's his name? Uh, Mac. Mac? Mm -hmm. Hey, Mac. Hey. Yeah, but he loved to come out to the, to the outdoor. In the Smell booth. my kitties? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Thanks for talking. Enjoy your day. You too. You never know what you're going to see on the beach. You got a friendly dog there. <laughs> Okay, that was cool. We got to see the Mac cat and a corgi over there. I'm just gonna stroll down the beach and try to get some looks at the other ones. did a great job from what I've seen so far considering they're designed by elementary kids it's, it's pretty awesome dogs participating dogs helping out and these kids over here are may not be participating in the contest, so maybe they are, but they're eager to build a castle. 
So you got individual castle builds out here. Yeah, I've never been out to one of these and it's pretty cool. And I'm telling you, the weather is perfect. Video doesn't convey the weather. The weather is super nice. It's, uh, like I said, 62 and sunny. What a perfect day to have this going on. At night, it's been cold, however. I mean, there's someone getting buried. Okay, she's up on the stage. Now I see where it's coming from once the music started. <laughs> the puppy. Hi, puppy. You can say hi. hi. Brody. Brody? Yeah, Brody. That's the Brody. Great name. Man, he's got name. some big paws to grow into. Yeah. Huh? Name for uh, Brodick Street. Three and a half months. Wow. He's got a lot of growing left to do. How you doing, buddy? Having fun? I just wonder what the heck's going on around here. Yeah, I bet. Cool. Enjoy him. Have a good day. You too. Here's a little mini one. That one's good. A little mini action. That one's a good one. This must be the people that made it. They make it? Yeah, they did. That's awesome. It looks great. Okay. Oh. <laughs> so this is what it is, huh? Oh, I see. That's what we're looking at. Very cool. Wow, look at this one. This one's very cool. I like the detail on this one. I think these are, this is a chessboard. And it's a snake and a spider. Now oh, they got a print out here. Let's take a look. Site 16. For detail, this one's probably the best. So far. The spider's detail. And the chess piece detail. So, the back of the spider and the front of the snake is pretty cool. Did a great job. Okay, here's another one to check out. Oh wow, dragon. That one's pretty awesome. I'm loving this one. Look at the detail of the dragon head. Alligator. The okay, the alligator is crazy. And the scales on the dragon and the giant pumpkin. This one's very good. It's a good one. Wow. They turn those drawings into reality here. That one's really good. Might be my top so far. Now here's another one. This is an octopus. Looks like it has some kind of cat ears to it. There's a claw there. I like the feathers for the hair. Check this one out. They made a grave or a tomb. Go around the other side and get a better look. 
like I would speculate that someone who died from either trigger. Yeah, well, you told me a bit of it was we gave the kids play. We went to the school, gave them play, kind of gave them free realm of what they wanted to do. They kind of wanted to do. That was pretty awesome, too. Let's pan over to the last one, it looks like. This one has a picture. It's got, looks like a coral or a castle. Some pumpkins. Uh, looks like maybe a dolphin or a shark. A haunted castle, pumpkin patch, and ghost. Let's walk around this one now that I know what it is. So haunted castle looks great. It's a brick. And the pumpkin looks like a double pumpkin. And this is site number drum roll. It doesn't have a site. Hmm. The Sand Castlers. Perkins and Will. Sponsored. We got a skull and crossbones there too. Look, this is the real picture. And the pumpkin. That's a good one. So I thought it might be a good idea that you guys can participate in this uh, competition in the comments. And why don't you post your favorite one and the reasons why. Um, because a lot of the participants that made this might watch this video and get a kick out of it. So, um, go ahead and participate if you want and in the comments and tell us why you like the particular one. Not all of them have numbers, but I think this one is 21, I think. You know why we're here, I might as well walk down to the ocean. I will be careful. I came here for the sand castles, but I'm gonna check out the ocean. And there are some surfers out there. I'm not sure what these guys are doing. Are they like building a trough or covering the trough? I don't know. It doesn't look like they're building. I think they're filling in. They're on a little slope here to the beach. So these old Dutch windmills, I actually did a video on that one, I think, one of those. I think it was that one. And then up a little further to the left is the San Francisco Zoo. And then the famous cliff house slash um, swimming pool, spa, bath. If you look at the history of this cliff house, it used to be a big swimming facility. And it actually caught fire in the 1800s and burnt down. Then it was rebuilt. And I think COVID killed the restaurant up there. I think. It used to be a kind of a high-end restaurant up there. And uh, they would have, um, you know, it's pretty popular. Now, the, if you see the little building on the left side of the big one, that's actually a giant camera it's kind of like a tourist thing and then below that building they used to have an arcade museum but they moved it to pier 39 you used to be able to go down in there and there was all these really old pinball machines and arcade games from the 20s and 30s 
wow. You know, the, the, the beach is looking pretty cool. The tide's obviously low right now. Lots of play in that 58 to 57 degree water. Uh, that is some cold water, I can tell you that right now. Very easy to get hypothermic. There's a surfer paddle boarder. He's got a wave. You see him? That's a good, decent wave. Nice. Good ride. Waves look like they're decent. Roll one in for these guys. I love the baby outfit. That is so awesome. <laughs> Loving your outfits. Very cute. Enjoy that. That's awesome. I think the kids are enjoying tearing apart maybe more than they did building it. I have to admit, that would be fun. <laughs> See who can take out the tower the fastest. <laughs> Without shovels, it might be. She's got the right idea. Might be a while. <laughs> Looks like fun to me. Were you kind of surprised? Were you thinking you did a great job, maybe? We're, we're, I mean, it's always a surprise. All we do is do the best we can, and the kids had great ideas, and we were able to run with them. And then, you know, the thing that we wanted to clear is we had to submit our design to the kids, and and then they approved it, and they made some, they had some minor changes, and we respected that. So it was a true collaboration, and so, yeah, we're just happy that uh, you know we got to this point. So like if you flip this around, like we had this team in 2019 and we like we, our names are on the back of it from there. And so like we're yeah. also like, very shocked that it was like <laughs> we had signed 2019. So we won. Yeah. The same partners and everything. So a big question I had is like did they cover this up and they totally didn't. Right here. But yeah, so, these like, are all our signatures. Right? <laughs> wow, wow, double I mean, winners. Yeah, so, like, that's what I was like, I can't believe we would have kept, but also, I was like, oh, I get to see if, like, we actually still have our names on there, and we were happy to see that Very we do. Cool. We promised to return it as a response. Like, One, two, three. Yeah. 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 Yeah.